The Sandpoint Bulldog season came down to a single play in the semifinals, a two-point conversion, and you could say Coach Knowles knows. Instead of kicking a PAT to tie it in overtime and keep things going, he elected to go for the win. Here's the result. Now they are a win away from a state title. Every week goes by. Uh, there's just less and less teams playing, and to, to be one of the only teams in the state still playing this week is, there's something about it, something special. Special indeed for any school, but you could argue it means a little extra in a town with a population around 9,000. Everybody knows everybody, so when you have a good game, you walk into a store and a couple people are like, hey, great game you had, I'm excited to see you next week, and it's like, all right, we, we mean some of this town, you know? A town that saw their Bulldogs get shut out by Skyline in the semifinals last season, and like deja vu, Sandpoint will meet Skyline a year later, this time for all the marbles. We left their stadium last year, uh, you know, disappointed, disappointed in uh, what could have been, and uh, you know, we get a chance to prove that uh, we thought we thought we were a better team. Yeah, it would be a whole revenge story, yeah. I mean, going over there and then losing to them in Madison, and then uh, all our excuse was, was if we'd have played them in the Dome, we would have won this game. So right now, if we play them in the Dome, we should bring it to them. Sandpoint has won one championship in 102 seasons of football. That was in 1997, just a year after Coach Knowles finished playing for the Bulldogs in 96. Now he has a chance at what he just missed. That was um, unfinished business in, in my terms, but uh, I, I have a lot of emotion about it, but I'm not going on the field. The boys are going to, and um, they're writing their own stories right now, and I'm trying to get them to embrace, embrace the emotions of this process as well, and uh, yeah, let's leave it all out there Friday night. And the players an opportunity to become hometown heroes. It's just the biggest thing you really, it, what I, I feel like I could do in this town as a person, honestly. Just knowing, growing up here and knowing what football means to this town, bringing a state championship is just the ultimate goal. And to see how the town reacted after the, that semifinal game, it, I can't imagine what it'll be like if we win. So I'm excited. Sandpoint State Championship game will be on Friday at 7 p.m. in the Kibbe Dome. Hey, stick around. We'll be back right after a break.